Oh, they're all broken except for the old man puzzle. Oh, it was so hard. So you remember, right? Three-legged baby. Uh, wait, what? Four-legged cute adult. Then one-legged old man. Old man hopping around. Yeah. Fucking what? That baby lost a leg in the war. Oh no. That's the solve puzzle. Four! Oh, I did it early. Let's get that trial of skill done. Glad I have Trickster here. Trick. Trick. Ah ha 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 ha. You know what? DC Sprint, makes it easier. Sprint would have made this way shittier because it would be harder to tell when the sprint would actually kick in. So DT also trivializes yeah, it. Yeah, of course. Because you move it like you what, fucking twice burp, burp, the speed. Burp, burp, burp. Left, Look at right, this. left, right. Boop. Oh, Did it. Ah, oh, what a much better way to get up here. But first. Get all those rorbs. No, not that. I'm getting them as a a matter of... I have to. But, um... You already got the blorb up there. And that, uh, so we just did that shit. Now let's do, do this, this shit. Okay. <laughs> it's... This one is... Much oh my God. tougher. Yeah, absolutely. I was gonna say, just pop it. Now, I'm not gonna have enough for the whole thing. No, but... It should ease the burden. So there's the thing where it's like, if you have level one trickster even, you can do it. Because they're moving... The fact that they're moving faster actually makes, makes it, easier. it easier. You have less precise timing on it. Yeah. The slower they move, the, the, the harder it is to, to position your, your, your dash. Alright. Because your hitboxes intersect for less time. Oh! Fucking go! These are your final grunts, and these dudes rule. They're great. <laughs> they fucking rule. They're great. I love them. They're super Th cool. One. This hallway is not going to show off why they're cool. To be perfectly honest. Nope. Hell no, it's not. And in fact, after this. Now that these guys are back on the scene, I'm actually going to be switching back to, uh, Swordmaster. Uh-oh. Oh, oh Wooly, your DualShock disconnected. What the? Oh, I guess the battery stayed fine for... for yours. Yeah. That's handy. Hey, come back here. So I love that they're just the first enemy in the game, but combined with... The second enemy in the game. And juiced. Very juiced. Super duper juiced. Again, you really, you don't want a hallway. You want a nice open room for this. Almost like some sort of circular arena. There you go. But the, it, the, the reason why they're awesome is because they fucking move. They, they're all over they the place. They move and you've got to keep up. And when you've got Trickster, it becomes an anime fight. It's great. It's great, it's great, it's great. I actually don't like Trickster against them because I like to lock them down and just beat on them until they die. That's, that's fair. just Pat. That's, that's fair. That's Pat's way of doing things. But, you know, they also attack in groups and they do. start overwhelming you and shit. But, like, they move more, if not, they, they move more and uh, than the spiders do. Oh, uh, you know what? We're not going to be going there quite yet. So, let's oh. go to Trickster for now. Oh. Okay. Oh, we're in the dark pack chamber, despite the fact that it's open air, for some reason. It's a chamber. Shut up, it's a chamber. It's a chamber. Oh yeah, no, no some goo! Kinda like how the pitch black void is not at all... Pitch black, or, or a even void. a void, yeah. Rut row. Shadow Link. <laughs> but not quite the same. Ask me some questions. 
Well, too bad. I've already answered them myself. I don't need you anymore. I like how the cutscene kind of gives you some hits. Come on, Dr. Koi. Yeah. Doppelganger. And he's bigger incarnate. than me. Um, he's bigger and betterer. How could I ever defeat him? So. Uh, oh, there it is. The cutscene kind of shows off the yeah. little light mechanic. I had it back. Also. The idea, I guess, is that Dante um, faced his demons oh my God, many really? times, and so he recognizes them. I recognize them. So that when one pops out, he thinks it's just another internal moment he's having, when actually it's an enemy fighting him. Oh yeah, you think he's that stupid? It's like, Dante, this time it has a life bar. <laughs> Your little freakouts in the past gotcha. didn't have a life bar. There you go. That's the true enemy. That's so you get you get the little ones if you. Uh, I like how he has better versions of a lot of my moves. That's the demon that's not obsessed with mother. Mother. Kill him! Kill him away! How dare he! Kill him for mother! Big blue pops. So it's one, two, three, one. Yeah, there it is. You gotta keep the light on it. Oh no. One, two, three. I kind of. Like, I get, like. As much as I would want this to be a Dante v. Dante, uh -huh. I guess the idea is that would take away from Virgil. You know? A little bit. So it's more of a little gimmick fight. Wah. You think you're so good. Did you hear him going crazy? I did. That's weird. It's super cool. Oh, boy. He's using my taunts and they're all disordered. It's fucking great. Fuck off. Think you're crazy? Well, you're not. God, like, it's, I, I never noticed that in the PS2 version. Straight up. Like, he, I, oh man. No. Come, come on. Unfortunately, he's an idiot. He, he falls for the same tricks over and over. He jumps out real quick. Gotcha. Oh no, there's one that I missed. Gotcha. Oh. What? One went out. One went out. Apparition. Look at that damage! Yeah. Apparition Incarnate is a pretty cool name. Oh, is that his name? Yeah. Cool. Doppelganger is just the, the style. Yeah. So it's kind of a lame boss fight because you can't actually seemingly attack him at all unless he is hit by the light, which makes it a pure gimmick fight. Mm -hmm. And as you can see, there's not much to it. Oh, that's what that is. Come on, come over here. You don't like it? Okay. It's like, why would you fight in this room? Because he can only exist in the light, because it's the shadow. <laughs> yeah. The shadow of mother. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I lost my shadow for a sec. Bro fist! First thing we do is a fucking Kirby dance. Cool, bro. 
<laughs> Doppelganger! Sometimes you need more than one Dante, then you can have two Dantes. How many Dantes do you need? So yeah, there's your, uh... There's your next sub-style. In or, fact, or... I believe, before finishing the mission, I can switch to that style. It's not one of the big four, but it's one of your And it's not four. coming back. <laughs> This fe that fight and the style feel like, hey, we actually had time to implement something. Someone had a cool idea. And they had the time left over to do it. So let's look, after image, create a dimensional light rift, causing a second shadow version of yourself to appear. So you get a clone that does whatever you do. You do. And you have to, it's, it, you cannot activate it by accident because it's too strong. And you can't activate it at all right now because I don't have it. I don't have any GT. Ha 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 ha. Burp. Oh well. Hey, let me just, uh, let me just, uh, you know. Eh? Uh eh? -huh. Uh -huh. Did you turn your, your baby? Th oh you just, no! Uh, here. You did it. Why'd you do that? Because your your battery might run out. Oh, my battery might run out, but then we'll switch to your game. Where you have everything maxed out, of course. Just sad. Again. 17 clear. Only, what, three more to the goal? Technically four. Getting there. Well then, let's wrap up this crazy party. Shall we? Yahoo! Like he's trying to sound serious. Yeah. Seen the 18. I like that that portal looks like the portal from DMC1. Oh, okay. Hmm. It's great. Hmm. Great little detail. Hmm. And this. this is this is this is some yeah. hotness. I like this. This is your. Game's ending. Let's switch those assets up. Let's reverse it. Put your thing down, flip it, reverse it. Why would hell look so nice? Exactly. Also, here's your DMC Devil May Cry. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you're super right. Mm -hmm. What's that? Oh! Oh, shit. It was all in preparation for this moment. Look at your fucking pawns. Hey! What's good? Whoa. You are wait, not controlling wait, wait, that. Wait, wait, There we go. Okay. And you left. Damn it, okay. <laughs> so it take you have seconds. But fuck. Oh yeah. I thought it was, uh, I thought it just, it would detect right away, but you have to, you have to hit the... The start. It'll be easier later. That being said, there you go, Wooly. You get technically played. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. So you gotta fight this full chessboard alone without my style, and that's the problem with that's the problem with Quicksilver and with um, Doppelganger mm -hmm. is that they're styles that only improve your already amazing Devil Trigger. Mm -hmm. Like it's it's super not worth it. And it all they also pretty much negate the ability to use DT explosion. What does circle do when you're coming okay, when you're Let's go? Wooly, this style sucks! It's not it's the so best bad in this moment because you get a couple seconds. It's so fucking bad. Just tell me when though, by the way. Just... No! No? Okay. <laughs> It's a, it's a fucking, uh, it's a, it's a... It's a great Easter egg. It's an Easter egg. It's a great Easter egg. Oh, uh, to the point that I think it even breaks compliance, because the game doesn't say two players on the back of the box, I don't think. But yeah, you're sacrificing a lot. Like, I think I'm gonna die, because I don't have real impact here, which is my favorite move ever. Oh, the Rook and the King! They're coming in. So you have to fight this, this chessboard. With, all, with half of my usual ability. And they don't take turns. No, not like a real chessboard. It's kind of bullshit. Oh, boy. Okay, you got some life. 
But yeah, you can only attack them when they're when they're like not dark. Yeah. As uh, the game itself has been teaching us so far. Thank goodness. You got your bishops. Gotta get this other bishop. I love castling. Jesus, it scares the shit out of me. Sorry. It does actual <laughs> castling. All right, I'm switching. Okay. So useful. So the main issue with this is in. the camera control. It is. It is. I got, but I, I, I got. I worked the body a little bit. This is so bad without Swordmaster. This is so bad. I get enough time for one combo. I can't switch <laughs> off fast enough. Like, holy shit. Uh, I'm not... Oh, You know where it's probably a good time? Why is that? Super Nante. Oh, yeah. Because it's actually a two-player mode. It's actually two-player mode. That is going to laughably trivialize the whole game. Maybe. Because some things drain meter, actually. I don't know if that... Yeah. There's some things that do actually drain meter, and I, that, I hope that's not one of them. But assuming it does not, that would be really fun. How do you get Super Dante? Is it beat DMD? Uh, I'm pretty sure it's beat SOS. SOS? That doesn't exist in this Or, game. or, um... No, hold on. Is it... Is it... I have to... I literally had it open. Um... I have a problem. I can't do the secret mission. You don't have the... Don't have Trickster on. Oh. Thanks, Wooly. Well, that was cool, though. Thanks for nothing. Hey, it was cool. You're welcome for cool. You're not welcome. The secret <laughs> mission failed. <laughs> uh, da -da 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 -da. Let's. That I'm actually. You know what? After this mission, I'm actually gonna start this mission up again and run to that and because that is one of the cool secret missions in the game. No problem. Um, unless I can find a time statue here, which I bet I can. Oh, in fact, sure enough. Sure enough. Okay, well, it was, it was nice. Let's put that fucking controller away. <laughs> I will not. Okay. <laughs> That's okay. I got some good hits in. You'll get a few hits in later, I'm sure. Where it actually, actually works much better. Yeah. All around, really. I, I actually, uh, it was years after I beat the game when I found that out. Mm. I didn't realize you were on, um. If we either for a second, and I was like, "Oh, let me do a oh no," but yeah, you get you get enough time for one extra combo, which is double damage in a lot of cases on top of DT damage. So it's yeah, there's a lot going on. Where the fuck does this? I wish there was. Ironically, I wish there was a first person mode right now, mm -hmm. just so I could see. Because this is a proper platforming challenge. Like, I don't even know where the... Oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah, d I completely do not remember this, this secret. Really? Version. Yeah. With Virgil, it's an actual nightmare, because he doesn't have Trickster. But some of them change for him, too. Yeah, but Dark Slayer is not Trickster. No, it's not. It's absolutely not. You got a, you, you've got a different set of teleports. All right. And you've got way less. Woo! Um, Part one done. Mobility in terms of just the little rolls and dodges. Like he's got up trick, up trick, down trick, which is good. And uh, you got neutral trick, and then, uh, and then uh, man, air trick. Down trick is fucking good though, which is why like really, you know, I've never, oh, I've never really uh, found uh, a lot of love for down trick. When you're floating and you don't want to be floating anymore after a couple swings, you down trick it. I suppose you're right. And, um... He gets the ability to do it. Uh... Like, they change it up a lot. In oh, fucking God. In 4, they change it up a lot because, uh... They make it, like, DT only. Right? Oh. And neutral neutral trick becomes... Goes away. Mm -hmm. And so, it, it, neutral trick becomes air. Anyway. Kill me, Wooly. 
I hope people are riveted by me discussing the differences between... You know what? The people watching at this point probably actually are. I mean, I gotta use the bathroom, quite frankly, so... Yeah, you know what? You go to the bathroom. I'll do that. Because there's gonna be a lot of shit right here in a minute. As I fucking... You know what's fun? Platforming games inside not platforming games. Isn't that great? Remember when Banjo-Kazooie had that fucking intense shooting sequence? Does everyone remember that? When Final Fantasy VII asked you to play Mahjong for three hours in order to get the ultimate weapon? You know what? They'd probably do that. Like, I joke, but Square Enix totally put a fucking mission like that in. Oh, my God. Okay, woof. That's the one. These two. They're so annoying! Oh, my God! And this camera is very bad. I tell you what. That is a bad camera. God fucking damn it. Just fucking secret missions. Just the last fucking secret mission of the game. It's the last one. So all I gotta do is this little baby secret mission here. Then I'll have beaten every single fucking secret mission. I beat the air raid one a little while ago. Oh, fuck. Oh my god, that was awful. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna fucking die. Is there a way to go straight up? Because that'd be really appreciated. Hey, guess what? This thing sucks. It would have been better if the, the crazy fucking... I, I wish the battle theme was playing. To be like, yeah, look at all this failure. <laughs> duh, duh. It's... Like, it's the fact that you fall all the way to the bottom if you fail it. That just really, really brings the piss to a hard boil. Feel free to die when you've had enough. Oh. <laughs> Oh, that was a good one. Oh, boy. Um... So, yeah, here we go. Uh... You saw it. Everyone saw it. With Super Dante, the players granted pseudo... Oh, yeah, yeah Super uh, Unlimited DT. Uh, here's the thing. On the original release for PS2, um... Go! The DT explosion will decrease the gauge. However, Quicksilver and Doppelganger do not. Uh, but they do in Special Edition. Uh, so they took the fun away. Well, you know why? Because probably because it was fucking broken. Because it was an unintended full game co-op. So the uh. so the trick is to ignore that <laughs> entirely. It's it's one Just of the, like that. It's, it's, yeah, there. it's a complete fucking farce. Yeah, it's fake. So the special edition removes the full game co-op because I guess there's probably bugs that. You know, exist only in that mode or some shit, but it was not intended for full game co-op. Hey, Willie, do you ever have something in a game that you absolutely adore, but everyone else hates it? Like, the general populace seems to just care for it? Royal Guard. Right. Well, I mean, like, something... <laughs> Why did I even do that? Because I said the word and I planted the seed. <laughs> but you know what I mean, right? I do. It's just I like, nobody, nobody likes it, yeah. nobody cares mm -hmm. for it. Mm -hmm. How do you feel about a good old-fashioned boss rush? Okay, it depends on the game. Mm -hmm. It depends on... Whether the bosses are fun to fight. Whether they're fun to fight or not. And, most importantly, whether or not your newfound abilities trivialize their asses. So, if you're bringing the boss back and it's an improved, harder version of the boss, and it's as much of a struggle, and it's, the game's been running long, and you're like, ah, right? So, so here's DMC3's boss rush, which is kind of amazing in my mind. Well, here's the, the most important part, is that you you don't actually have to do them all. No, you don't. All you have to do is create a line from the top to the bottom. So uh, the purple one, I forget which one it is, I think it's Nevin, you have to do, right? But you have to do one of the middle ones, any of them, and you have to do one of the bot. you know? No, you just, you just have to cr 
create a, a circle. It, it's, a, it's a circle? I you, thought it was a line. You just have to create a unit. I'll be honest, I don't know how it works because I've always beaten every single one. Okay. <laughs> I, okay. I don't yeah. know how it works. So if you did purple, blue, white, and green, mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure you'd be done. And you will fight them all in, in, these, the reborn. in these little cool arenas. Reborn form. Yeah. So, again, if you've been having a good time and you've mastered... And you like to fight the bosses. And you've, at this point, hopefully mastered your abilities, then yeah, why not? Why not? However, um, the fact that you don't have to do them all clearly shows that they're like, they know not everybody's going to enjoy that. Yep. Mega Man, right? Great example. You're fighting them. They're pretty much the same. And... You have their weaknesses. So sure. fuck them up. Just fuck them up. So there's absolutely no problem with that in Mega Man. Because you know exactly what to do. And most of the weaknesses, like, trivialize those fights. You just have to make sure you have enough resources. Um, so here, it's like, do I remember how to beat Nevin? But on top of that, do I have the health to beat all of them? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But you don't have to do all of them. No, but, so I'm, I, but I, I'm going to. But I think it's I, <laughs> I think it's fine. In this game, it's fine. In four, I think it's quite bad. Uh, well, here's the the thing with four is that you also have you have the fucking uh, the dice, right? And yeah. as, as exploitable as that is, if you don't know how to exploit it, it's you fucking spend forever losing your shit. <laughs> and. Uh, and yeah, if you don't know how to exploit that dice, that shit sucks. The other problem with the dice too is that sometimes it just doesn't work properly. Like there's a there's a there's a window. Oh, wrong button. Whoops. There's a window where you hit it at, on the right number, but it's still like, nah, you were a little too late. Fuck off, Nevin. So yeah, confusion can make four's thing last forever. Here, it's it's not that bad. Yeah. So the uh, if. We ever were to, I don't know, play the fucking four, I don't know. We'll discuss how to exploit that dice. Are you saying, however, that this is a hated feature? Right uh, a lot of people complain about boss rushes in games. Oh, okay. Like a lot, a lot, a lot. That was unfortunate. What's an example of a really bad one? Four. <laughs> <laughs> uh, games where you can clearly tell they don't have enough bosses. So they just throw bosses at you again. Well, here's the other thing, though. 4 is a little bit different as well, because 4 has you going forward and backwards, fighting them twice anyway. Yeah. Even before you get to that point. You fight those bosses three times, in most cases. You do. Except for the only boss you'd actually want to fight more than once. <laughs> God damn it. Fucking Credo. Son of a bitch. It's why, the worst. Why, it's, you, gotta, it's why the worst. you gotta bring me down, bro? Why you gotta bring me down? DMC4 uh, has, like, five bosses total. Most of them you fight three times. Some you fight twice. And the best boss in the game you only fight once in the dead center of the middle of the game. Instead of getting one, two, and three. And it's a bummer. Imagine what that would have been like. Oh, <sighs> That's yeah. what I think. Also, the thing you get from it is a bummer, too. But we'll get, we'll get there. Don't worry. Oh, who we are? Oh, oh, we even know. Yeah, I, I'm, there must be something out there where, like, this boss is. Oh, bad. man! That is so. That's the second time I've done that. That's awful for me. Uh, Kirby games are always fun with it, too. I enjoy them. Oh, yeah, you know what? You would like boss rushes if you like them, them and Kerbos. Those are great. Having double jump on all of these bosses is ironic, is you know, ironically because air hike sucks, but it's honestly like much easier. Stop laughing. Stop it. So yeah, you get it by uh, to answer that question from a while ago. Um, Super Dante and Super Virgil yeah. are DMD, BMD, or Bloody Palace. Be Bloody Palace. Yes. And that's what I, I was like. I, I, I remembered it being. I, I, I only thought it was Bloody Palace. I sure as fuck have never beaten a Bloody Palace. Um, because the reward for beating Bloody Palace is you get the thing that trivializes Bloody Palace. You And the whole rest of the game, honestly. Like, because. Yeah, like if you've done it once, then you then it's a, just a joke. 
Because using super form on, uh, on those is just like fucking everything melts. Also, you got your jeans. There's all kinds of fun stuff you can wear. You're not gonna do the trick? I wanna be able to see the trick. There it is. Yeah. Pop. You're invincible to it when you're DT'd. You can't escape. Oh, you escaped! Quite easily. Hey, guess what? All command grabs in the franchise follow that rule. As far as I know. I might be wrong somewhere in there. In fact, I probably should have said down. it with such gusto. You said it with some significant gusto. <laughs> but uh, other command grabs that bosses land on you, you DT pop out of them. Same thing for enemies as well. Don't raise the